yeah welcome today to my uh, little cooking show we are gonna have Barbie's hats in a fabric softener and it's gonna make a nice little soup yeah yeah actually I um, googled a little bit how to take care of Barbie dolls hats because I hated how they looked and I'm gonna share my knowledge with you today and I'm gonna try out these uh, very helpful tips I got from the internet um, and I hope they're really working I'm not quite sure so uh, since the Barbie's hair which was like the worst thing of all is uh, some sort of plastic fiber uh, the internet suggested that we use fabric softener as a yeah, as a way to soften the hair and make it more um, manageable. And I'm gonna try this out now. This is like a bowl with water and some fabric softener and uh, I put some hats in there already and I'm trying to brush them and make them look uh, nice and presentable so they won't disgrace my uh, awesome little light show lamp later. Um, this so far does not work at all. I can't really come through. Maybe I need more fabric softener, even though there's a lot of it in it already. Actually, I have no idea what happened to these Barbies and uh, why the hair is so weird. Probably, yeah, well, I guess it, it just happens after years and years of playing with them. Uh, yeah, well, anywho. I'm trying to brush this girl's head and yeah I'm gonna try out this thing and then I have also uh, two other Barbies that have like uh, some sort of you could call it a uh, whole face makeup in black and some uh, sunspots which maybe may or may not be they look like what's it called mold actually I'm not sure so for this case I brought some um, nail polish remover and some uh, like cotton swabs and I'm gonna try uh, and clean the faces of the Barbies and I also got those little thingy thingies so I can, since they're all blonde and since I always wanted to cut like some Barbies hair and this one looks yeah actually she looks quite funky which is cool we're gonna make i think i'm gonna make this one a mohawk no not this one that's another one this one i'm gonna make her a mohawk yeah and we're gonna have a little bit of fun with the barbies today yeah it's like uh playing real time barbies uh we've now returned to childhood uh actually my mother told me I shouldn't cut the hair of my dolls and then I did it anyway and I regretted it and I don't know why we ever as children where we ever okay we maybe we don't know better but we could like make like try to make like something of a haircut of it but uh, usually it ends up in total disaster like I don't know whatever some of these girls Actually, there's, there was a bunch of hair, just I don't know where it came from, it's like, I didn't know it could like uh, de deconstruct, so to say, it's like, it's all over there, I need to vacuum later, and I don't know what's happened or what's happening, is it like, is the softener from the, the plastics, is it like getting out and it's all bristly and I don't know, but anywho, um, yeah, let's have a look, I'm gonna brush this one here then maybe she can have some uh yeah a second life oh jesus i had dreadlocks once when i was in 16th grade i was in canada all alone my parents didn't come with me i was there for a year and then i thought it was a really good idea to get dreadlocks uh, it didn't look that good actually and it was a pain to take care of like short hair is way easier to take care of 
So don't ever get dragged vlogs because you think it's easy. It's like, it's a hassle. Yeah, and my mom convinced me to get them all cut off. And then I had like a nice uh, eagle frisur. A nice, uh, what do you call it? I was a jarhead, basically. Okay, so maybe this is gonna work. I have no idea what happened. What is this? Something's on there. Okay, whatever. Sometimes I think they, to make them like, get them like hairstyles, they were like sewn on or something like this with those Barbies. Yeah, and actually what really does not look good on Barbies is those little, looks more like a ball, not anything like a person. Those hair yeah, thingies. Okay, so what are we gonna do with this one? Maybe this could be, I don't know. Maybe we could make like an eagle frisur? Eagle, a hedgehog. We are making her a hedgehog. Or maybe like a fukuhila. That would be awesome. Yeah, that's great. Let's do a fukuhila. Um, so we need to take off stuff on the top, which has already happened. Actually, I have this little nice little comb. I'm trying to brush it somewhere and then get it like to... Um, actually, please tell me, has anybody tried like vacuum style self uh, hair cutting? Like where you would put like an electric razor in front of the vacuum and then suck all your hair in and then cut it. Has anybody tried that yet? I think that's a good question for Corona time. Please tell me if this works. So we want to take away a lot from the top, but keep like from this point down for the Fukuhila. Ah, I think in English it's called the mullet. Yeah, we're going to do a mullet and I'm going to try to keep the hair that's lower. Actually, I have no idea how a mullet looks or how it's like if there's a thing like, like, a, I don't know if you go to the barber and then say, oh, I'd like to have a mullet, please. And then they cut it this way or if it just evolves. Maybe or it's a mom cut. Only moms can do it. 80s moms. And there's some sort of uh, textile, uh, what do you call it, thread in this. I think somebody sewed something to together or something, I don't know. I don't know what this is, this looks burned. I think those Barbies, when I looked this, at these hats, they were like, uh, yeah, used to a lot of hatred from little girls. So that's why they look like this. Hey, maybe it would be so much easier to just give your hat to the barber shop. You can say, hey, I'm gonna get it back later. While I just work with my hand. Okay, this has to go. Oh, somebody, oh, somebody was really clever. They painted the hat in red. So you couldn't see the, the holes where the skin poked through. Clever, clever. I'm gonna do this with a black haired one. Great idea. Actually, I think there's something like it. I, I saw something from like an artist and she uses like some sort of powder on her head skin because she uh, has like thinning hair and she doesn't want anybody to see it and then she uses powder in the color of her hair and then she powders the skin 
And so it doesn't, it's, well, it's not that obvious. You can't see it right away. Actually, I should blow dry this, but I don't really, I don't even own a blow dryer, so. Huh. How can we do this? Yeah, well, I think I need to cut off some more. Like it has to, I think it should be a crisp line. Oh, I should cut off this also. We need a crisp line for the Fukuhila. It's gotta be for the mullet. It's gotta be a real mullet. It doesn't, it doesn't supposed to look like an accident mullet. It's gotta be a real one. So, oh, and then I need to even this out. Oh, this is too long. Okay, this is getting old. I'm gonna try the new project for you and see if you like this better. Um, this is the one with the ugly face. And I'm gonna use some cotton swabs and try to repair this. So, every time I see like acetone, which this basically is. Acetate, acetone, acetone. My brother comes to mind because he told me you always should close your bottle of acetone because the pressure of this fluid on which it uh, just, what you call it, evaporates is so low that even if you open this can, like this um, air of acetone is coming out and then you will just lose it really fast. So always put the top back on. Oh, this is going really well. I didn't even take off the, the uh, schminke. schminke, the makeup, it's still on there. Maybe I can take it off. Let's have a look. Maybe we can do like a 90s Barbie with no eyebrows. No eyebrows, Barbie. Let's have a look. I'm going to try it on this one. Yes, it works. So this Barbie now has no eyebrows. <laughs> Looks weird, right? Can you see this? I don't know. Okay, oh, this hair is also like... Actually, I uh, saw something in the internet, on the internet, and there is uh, a curling iron for Barbies. So you can... This is like the next level. I should do this the next time. But actually, well, I thought about it, and then I thought, okay, maybe I can use like some pens. Maybe I use this Barbie hat or get another one with long hair, like super long hair. But this is also, oh, I have it everywhere. It's everywhere, the fucking hair. Uh, okay. Anywho, I'm going to take this one. I'm going to try out the curling method. I'm going to let it dry and show you next time if it works. So today. In the beauty salon Prinzmann, we're gonna have a perm, which is not gonna be a perm at all. Okay, I think I have to brush this one. Oh, fuck off. Oh. Man, good, good, good. This fucking hair. Maybe you can next time you just, just do like cable hair. Just have cables on the Barbie's head. And I don't even know where can I put this water. I can't put it down the drain. It's it's gonna clog my drain so badly with all the hair inside, which is not hair, which is some polyester thingy. I don't know. Okay, hello, young lady, what's cooking? Okay, actually I want to try and um, twist it around my pen. Where do I start? I don't know. Um, actually I have no idea how to do this. As you can see, I never do this. It just appears on my head. Okay. 
She doesn't really have much hair though. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna try and twist it around this uh, pen. And then I have this little thingy. No, it's not working. Oh, it's so slippery. Fuck off. Uh, um, wait for it. How is this not working? Ah, no. Okay. No, no, no. Fuck. Okay. Sometimes it's hard to be a woman. Perfect. This looks perfect. She's gonna be the most beautiful one, I guess, in the end. Just perfect. You can't even see the skin on her head. Because she has so much hair. Okay, I don't know what to do with the rest. Maybe curl it also. Yes, let's do it. Ah, fuck off. Now I broke it. Fuck! Why is this so hard to open? Plug it in, plug it in. Shit. Okay, this is not working. She's gonna have one curl. I'm gonna tell you if this works. Oh, fuck off. No, this is not gonna work. I'm not gonna do it. Okay, what can I do now? Um, Maybe cry. This one looks really weird. She has like super... She looks like an alien. Doesn't she look like an alien? An extraterrestrial? What's happened with the eye? Well. Oh. Well, I'm gonna fix this one. If she can be fixed. I sh she looks burnt. I'm gonna take a new one. And I lost all of my acetone. Great again. Great again. Ooh, this works. Great. Well, actually, she looks like a, a little raccoon. Like she's in, uh, she's in disguise. She's like, yeah, it's Halloween or something. La, 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 la. E. She lost an eyebrow in the meantime. Sorry about that. Oh, she almost lost the eye. This is the beauty salon of doom. Lose an eyebrow, lose an eye. Okay, fuck. This looks... I don't think she's solvable. She's gonna be something else. I don't know. Um, maybe... Yeah, let's have a look. Okay, this Fokuhila woman. Is she good enough? Is she? I'm not really sure. I think I should cut this some more. Yeah. 
This should be cut some more. Actually, I find that they also probably because the hair is all parted in the middle so they have like a lot of hair here and then not so much underneath so I maybe should do a mohawk or something like this with the next one I really should because I think here's the most hair for them and I will gonna I'm gonna cut off the rest Okay, great, great. Those eyes are really creepy. Maybe I can take them off and draw different eyes on them. Okay. This is the one I showed you earlier. She has the glue on her head like really badly, but this actually feels fine now. Maybe it was something, I don't know, water soluble. Great! It was great! Whoa! This is success, people! Success! Oh shit, there's a lot of hair coming out. I don't know if... Maybe you shouldn't brush them too hard because they will all lose their hair. Okay, maybe I'm gonna make this one the mohawk one. She had like really a lot of hair, more than the others. Okay, okay. Does she have hair in the middle? Let me have a look. I can't really see it. But maybe later I will find out if she has hair in the middle. Hmm, didn't look like it. Maybe I need the other one. I'm gonna take this one. I would say the hair is basically gone, so just cut it off. This is not savable, so hopefully she has enough for the mohawk. Yeah, this is this is awesome. She looks great. She's like, yeah. I'm gonna be Vivian Westwood one day. Hey, she's. Almost already a mohawk. Look at this. Look at this. Okay, I'm gonna try to neaten it up a little bit by brushing it all to the top. Hopefully it works. What is this fuss shit shit shitty shit? Okay, never let your children watch this because I use a lot of swear words. Which I don't know why children shouldn't hear because they're gonna use them later so I don't know. <sighs> Fuck off. I hate this. I never do my hair. I just leave it wet and then sleep on it and then it's perfect. I hate caring for hair. Oh, fuck. What is this glue? Does she have there? It's glue, I think. Great again. Maybe, who knows what this is. gonna be nice. It's gonna look awesome. So awesome. Yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck off. Oh, Jesus. It's worse than my dreadlocks. It's a dreadlock. 
It is the dreadlocks. It's the Rastafari. The Rastafari. Rastaman body. Rasta woman. That's hot. I'm making a mess. Okay, now have a look. What is this? I don't need this. Okay, this looks better. Okay, can I, should I cut down the hair here or should I just, hmm. Maybe I should just brush it up to the top and then put some glue in it. <laughs> ah, ah, this looks nice. It actually, actually looks good. <laughs> I like it. Okay. Um. This is what she could look like, like this. And maybe I don't really need to cut it. It's like it's perfect this way. Great success. So. In the meantime, I'm gonna make over all my Barbie heads so I will have a presentable organ to show you next time. And I think next time I'm gonna make a little song with my organ. Um, yeah, so come and watch me next time while making a song. Yeah, great again. Okay, bye bye.